Kumpo dance, also known as stick dance, is a traditional African dance form that originated in the western regions of Africa, particularly among the Mandinka people of Guinea, Senegal, and Gambia. This energetic and rhythmic dance style is performed with long sticks or staffs, hence the name stick dance. The Kumpo dance is often performed during special occasions, festivals, and cultural celebrations. It holds great significance as a way of preserving cultural heritage and passing down traditional knowledge from one generation to another. The dance is usually accompanied by live drumming and other traditional musical instruments, creating a vibrant and infectious rhythm. The dancers hold one or two long sticks in their hands, which are used to strike the ground, create beats, and enhance the visual spectacle of the performance. The movements in Kumpo dance are characterized by quick footwork, dynamic jumps, spins, and coordinated stick strikes. The dancers display agility, strength, and skill as they perform intricate patterns, often in sync with one another. The dance incorporates both solo and group performances, with dancers showcasing their individual style and contributing to the overall synchronized choreography. Beyond its entertainment value, Kumpo dance serves various cultural purposes. It can be a form of storytelling, relaying historical events, or conveying messages related to community values and social issues. It is also seen as a way to strengthen community bonds, promote unity, and celebrate shared identity. While Kumpo dance originated within specific African communities, it has gained recognition and popularity beyond its cultural roots. Today, you may find Kumpo dance being performed in various parts of the world, both by African diaspora communities and enthusiasts who appreciate its vibrant and rhythmic artistry. In Kumpo dance, dancers often wear traditional attire that reflects the cultural aesthetics of the region. This can include vibrant and colorful clothing, such as flowing robes, head wraps, and decorative jewelry. The attire adds to the visual appeal of the dance and enhances the overall cultural experience. Drumming plays a central role in Kumpo dance. Skilled drummers accompany the dancers, providing a rhythmic foundation for the movements. Traditional African drums, such as the djembe and dunun, are commonly used, along with other percussion instruments. The music created by the drummers adds intensity, energy, and a sense of unity to the dance. Kumpo dance often incorporates symbolic movements that depict various aspects of life, such as hunting, farming, or ancestral rituals. Dancers may use their sticks to mimic actions like chopping wood, hunting animals, or engaging in battle. Through these movements, the dance not only entertains but also serves as a means of storytelling and cultural preservation. Like many traditional art forms, Kumpo dance has evolved over time. While it continues to be performed in its traditional form, it has also been influenced by modern choreography and fusion with other dance styles. Contemporary adaptations may incorporate elements from different cultures, bringing a fresh perspective while still honoring the essence of the dance. Kumpo dance has the potential to address social issues and act as a platform for activism. Some contemporary interpretations of the dance incorporate movements and gestures that highlight topics such as social justice, environmental concerns, or political activism. This showcases the adaptive nature of Kumpo dance in reflecting the changing times and addressing contemporary issues. Kumpo dance has influenced and inspired various other dance styles and genres. Its rhythmic patterns, dynamic movements, and cultural elements have been incorporated into contemporary African dance, Afrofusion styles, and even global dance forms. This cross-pollination has contributed to the diversity and evolution of dance worldwide. Kumpo dance plays a vital role in the preservation and transmission of cultural knowledge. Elders and experienced dancers pass down the dance techniques, cultural stories, and values associated with Kumpo dance to younger generations. 
It is often taught within communities, schools, and cultural organizations as a way to keep the traditions alive and instill a sense of cultural pride. In certain African communities, Kumpo dance is believed to possess healing and spiritual qualities. It is seen as a way to connect with ancestral spirits and invoke blessings for the community. The dance can be accompanied by chants, invocations, or ritual elements, enhancing its spiritual dimensions and serving as a form of cultural and spiritual expression. In some traditional African societies, Kumpo dance has specific gender associations. For instance, men and women may perform separate dances or have distinct roles within the dance. However, these gender roles can vary depending on the region and the specific cultural context. In contemporary settings, Kumpo dance is often more inclusive, with men and women participating together. Kumpo dance is often a communal activity involving both dancers and spectators. It brings people together, fostering a sense of unity and belonging within the community. Spectators may join in by clapping, singing along, or responding to the calls and movements of the dancers, creating an interactive and immersive experience. Kumpo dance requires a combination of physical stamina, coordination, and skill. Dancers must master the intricate footwork, jumps, spins, and stick movements with precision and agility. The dance demands a strong sense of rhythm, as dancers must synchronize their movements with the drumming and other musical elements. <laughs> And that's it for today, I hope you all have enjoyed this video. Please make sure to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit on the notification bell. See you in the next video.